The rules, which include a list of banned items, conduct and a warning to people wanting to bring children, has been issued by the government. A ceremonial procession will precede the lying in state and will convey the Queen's coffin to Westminster Hall, with the first people paying their respects from Wednesday evening. The public will be able to see the procession in person at the ceremonial viewing areas along the processional route or at a screening in Hyde Park. Significant warnings have been issued over the waiting times, which will most probably exceed 12 hours, with little time for sitting. Those wishing to make the journey to pay their respects to the Queen have also been told to consider whether it will be appropriate to bring children due to the sheer amount of waiting. A government statement says, please note that the queue is expected to be very long. You will need to stand for many hours, possibly overnight, with very little opportunity to sit down, as the queue will keep moving. Please consider this before you decide to attend or bring children with you. But those who choose to join the huge lines waiting to see the coffin up close will have guidelines to follow. This includes taking part in an airport-style security check, with people being told to only bring one small bag each, and that it must have a simple fastening. Any large backpacks or bags that exceed the recommended sizes will be kept in a bag drop facility, which has limited space and will add to an individual's already very long queuing time. People may need to wait for space to become available before leaving their bag. The statement continues, you are only permitted to bring one small bag per person into the Palace of Westminster. It must be smaller than 40 cm by 30 cm by 20 cm, with one simple opening or zip so you can move quickly through the security check. The items banned from the parliamentary estate include any items that may be used as weapons, sharp items, and cuddly toys which some may want to place in tribute. Sharp objects, liquids and food are also prohibited, with any drinks or snacks consumed in the queue before entering. Sprays, banners or marketing materials are also not allowed. Prams that do not fold will not be allowed, along with sleeping bags, camping chairs, cool bags, blankets and sleeping bags. And if security believes there is an incident unfolding, people are asked to follow their instructions. The statement concludes, if there is a security incident or you spot a suspicious item, alert the stewards or the police and follow their instructions.